The following portion of the Arizona Daily Mix is sponsored by Land Rover Chandler. Well, hi, and welcome to another one of Wally's Weekend Drives. Man, I'll tell you what, I am excited for sure. Why is that? We're checking out the new Land Rover Defender right here, and I'm joined right here by Gavin Hill, the general well, sales manager, sales manager, I should say, not general sales manager, just sales manager yep. here. He is the guy that knows all the facts and he's the guy that works the numbers. So we'll talk to him when we get to the back and talk about the MSRP. But first of all, let's go ahead and take a look at the new Defender right here. 2024 Defender, hasn't really changed much from 23, but man, these things rock. Um, you know, if you're looking to be impressed and surprised, come on down here and check one of these out talk to gavin and take one for a test drive what you're going to find is these things are far more responsive and handle far better than anything in the past when i think of the defender or land rover in general i think of the old paris to the car videos you used to see sure. where these things were like stuck down in the ruts and they were still motoring yeah. through and everything now they've actually turned into more of a street jeep now gavin your wife has one right yes she does loves it yeah loves it okay now, i pay i pay dearly for it yes <laughs> okay yeah. i'm thinking tickets wise too because i saw her go by me the other day on the freeway and she yeah. was like motoring pretty good uh, but if you look right here what you see is great lighting up front uh, definitely coming down the road at night people can pick you out of a crowd for sure and if you look you got great little driving lights down here you got air vents right there that go back to your brakes for cooling for sure and did i mention this thing is powered by a three liter six cylinder that's making 395 horse and 406 foot pounds of torque Correct. and it's all-wheel drive yep standard standard and yep. it goes in this particular vehicle has 22 inch wheels on it now, this is the part where we talk about the street Jeep versus off-road. Yep. Uh, you actually offer, what, three different, four different wheels? Yes. Yes, okay, so uh, all the way down to the steel. You this get is a steel a, wheel. Yes, yes, you, steel wheel, if you're definitely going off-road, you want the steel wheel. Right, give you the more clearance and it also gives you that play in the suspension as it's doing the, the work for you. That's right. Now, if you look on the side here, what you'll see is foldable electric heated also uh, side mirrors that basically have your blind spot control in it also got everything going on for sure and if you go inside when you look inside Grady what you're going to see is a just a man I'll tell you what this is supposed to be an off-road vehicle and it's more like a luxury vehicle it really is yeah they've got the, the the fine touch points down the aesthetics of it is very easy to use on the operation the controls a lot of voice controls navigation Apple uh, CarPlay everything that you'd want out of a luxury car, you'll have it in this luxury SUV. That's so, right, yeah. and a generous amount of USB and USB-C outlets yeah, too, yeah. that I thought was pretty cool. Charging e pad as well. Yeah. Yes, yeah, right yep. in the center, easy to get to, yep. and I always forget my phone when I have it in oh, the charger, I yeah. swear. Uh, it's yep. great though. But in the back here, the back seat is a 40-20-40 split. So if you have something extra that you need in the back, you need some more room, you can actually split that rear seat into three different sections. It can be as an option. Some of them are the 60-40, but you, as you talk about there, you can do that as well. You can get a setup that kind of accommodates across all needs. And, yes, uh, it does. It, so, it's, yep. Yeah, in fact, if you have like maybe a set of skis or something, uh -huh. you put the center 20 down. camping and, gear. You go right through there for sure. Be. Yep. That's right. Now, one thing that I really liked about the Defender here too, and I'm sure the other Land Rovers have it also, but from a convenience standpoint, check this out. A great little organizer right yeah. here that comes with it. And that's a big deal when it comes to it. Along with that spare tire, we normally have to look underneath here for the spare tire, but the Defender has been so great that they just put it right out there where we can see it for sure. That's it. Um, now, one thing for certain, MSRP on this, $87,973. Now, not certain if you have any incentives going on right now or not, but if you're not looking for a Defender, maybe you're looking for something else, right? Yeah, sure. Yeah. yeah, tell me about this car. So that's a Land Rover Discovery. That's kind of the bread and butter of our lineup as well. Very capable off-road, and there's incentives on varying models in our lineup. The APR specials right now on the Land Rover Defender, and we have some cash specials on the Discovery model, as you see there. Velar models, we have a $4,000 rebate available to current Land Rover owners. So we'll cater to all types, and there's different programs that kind of fit your needs uh, for, the, for the grand scale of what, what will we do here. But the Discovery is one of our uh, leading 
cars that has that third row seat, that stadium se uh, seating for the big family. That's so, right. Yeah. So whether you're going off road or more on road, yeah. stop down and see Gavin here. He's going to take care of you and he's going to get you that incentive that you deserve. The preceding portion of the Arizona Daily Mix was sponsored by Land Rover Chandler.